everyone and welcome back to the black diamond heist casino and in this video i'm going to show you a faster and more easier way to do this heist stealthily and all we're going to need for this heist is a battering ram a sticky drill and a lock pick so let's get this one started okay once we start this heist you want to grab your duffel bag and place your sticky drill and your lock pick both inside of it Next, grab your battering ram and head to the front of the casino. The reason why we're doing it this way is because some of you commented in my last video, if we don't have to unlock the door in the guard's break room, the guard on the other side with the blue key card won't actually have access to the guard's break room. Once we get to the front of the casino, head past the main desk area, hang it right until you see the staff only door. Next, taking our battering ram, we're gonna break open the staff only door, break open the door to the utility room, turn off the alarm, grab our battering ram and head out the front of the casino. And since we turn off the alarm to the casino, we can actually take a shortcut by going out this window and heading back to the truck to start the next phase of the heist. Once we get back to the truck, place our battering ram on top of our duffel bag, grab our guns, grab our duffel bag, and now we're gonna take an immediate left from the truck and go to this first door and break it down with our battering ram. After doing so, leave our duffel bag here, open this door, take our battering ram, hide underneath this camera, and break open the door to the security room. Once we do that, shoot the guard, zip tie any civilian that goes near him, take the phone and do the check-in. Now the guard from upstairs should get alerted. What we're gonna do is shoot him, take our batter ram, we're gonna place it at the bottom of these stairs, take his phone, go up these stairs and do the check-in at the top of the stairs. Next, we're gonna grab our duffel bag, go over here to this door, Take our lock pick out and unlock this doorway. After unlocking this door, take our sticky drill, throw it inside. Shoot the guard inside, take his phone, do the check-in on the wall, grab the sticky drill and place it on the top lock. Once we do that, we're gonna go back outside. We're gonna grab our battery ram, break open the door to the manager's office, break open the side door here, head down these stairs and we're gonna take out the next two guards. After you got these two guards, take their phones and do the check-ins on the wall. After doing that, we're gonna head back to the vault. Before we go back to the vault, make sure you grab the laser key card off the desk. Grab our duffel bag. Head inside the vault area. Place our laser key card on this table. Take our lock pick and unlock both these doors in the vault area. Now the next step what we're gonna do is take our laser key card, disable the lasers, take our drill and place it on the top lock of this vault door. Now we're going to take our lockpick and we're going to go to the next phase. By taking our lockpick, go up these stairs like we did before. We're going to unlock this door, open this door. And now we're going to wait for this guard to pass by. Once this guard walks by, we're going to shoot the two mobsters, drag their bodies inside. Close the shutter door. Now we're going to take one of the mobsters hands. Scan this door, go inside and zip tie all the civilians. After doing so, we're gonna grab our lock pick and we're gonna unlock this final door. And just like that, we have access to all the loot areas. And after doing so, we shouldn't have to worry about any guards throughout the rest of the heist and we can loot like normal. Now, a couple tips to loot this area a lot faster. What I recommend doing is setting up beforehand and have all the chips in their own bag and using the cart to take away all the money. That way you can take the money back in one shot, dump the cart, come back and grab the chips. And simply for the chips, all you're gonna do is the one bag method. And for the left side, just use the cart. And what I recommend to loot this much faster is using two bags specifically for wine bottles. Make sure to grab the one off the bar and the 12 behind the bar counter and using the cart for the big stuff. But if you do it the cart way, just be careful not to let go when the cart's airborne. Otherwise, everything will go everywhere. Another tip before I go, if you're going out the roof access way, since you can't jump onto this ledge if you're holding the cart, let go of the cart when it's stable, hop up on the ledge, grab the cart now, and now you'll be able to drag it over to the ledge. Do this until you have all the loot. All right, guys, this was a faster and easier way to do the Black Diamond Heist Casino. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe to help the channel grow, and I'll see you in the next video.